right, man, listen, new video, changing things up a little bit this time. I got Clay Thompson, and I'm gonna be coloring Clay Thompson in six different mediums. So I'm not doing different styles, I'm gonna do different mediums. I got the clays right here, so we gotta hop right into it. You can see I started off with the alcohol markers. You know, start off comfortable. This is my medium of choice, what I normally use in all my drawings. I'm trying to get the easy ones first and then slowly move into what I think is gonna be the most difficult. Now, if you've been on this channel, you know normally I do different styles, draw NBA players or people in different styles. I just, I switched it up. I never tried different mediums. I know Casey Golden made a video like this a while back. Slu just made a recent one. And I, you know, I wanna see how the different mediums could change uh, the same drawing up using different mediums, different materials to color it. I'm interested in seeing which one comes out looking the best. You know, I wanna, I, I think it's gonna be the alcohol markers just cause I have the most experience with it. But you know, I got, I gotta see which one comes out the best. Right here, man, I completed the first medium, which was alcohol markers. Got that clay done. I actually messed up, I had to start all over. But anyway, we gotta move on. You can see I had to squeeze the ink into the brush so I could be able to use this. But anyway, for this clay, the second medium, I'm gonna just be using my multi-liners, this brush pen, this ink brush pen that I got. So we got, I, I gotta see how this one comes out. Aside from the mediums and focusing on who I'm drawing, I had to do Clay Thompson. You know, he got requested a lot. He's in the finals right now. At the time of this video, he's in the finals at least. You know, he got one of the best shooters of all time. With all that being said, I still got the Celtics winning in the finals. I'm sorry. I, I still got the Celtics in the seven. I'm going to stand by my prediction, but you know, we had to do clay. I used the grit method, by the way, to draw these clays in the um, transfer paper to get them all in these boxes. Here's a second medium right here, the inking. You know, I haven't, I haven't struggled so far, so we got to up the difficulty a little bit. Let's move to the next medium. This time around, we got the Posca paint markers, as you can see. Now, I don't have um, a skin tone set for the Posca paint pen, so I'm gonna have to, you know, I'm gonna have to get a little bit creative with the colors that I'm gonna use for this. I'm gonna change things around. You can see I'm giving them blue hair, but yeah, I'm gonna, I'm gonna get a little bit creative, see what I can do with these. You gotta figure something out. Making some progress. Make sure y'all like to, if you get a chance, hit the like button, it does help out a lot. You can see the Posca paint pen version of clay is loaded up. This is my favorite out of the medium so far is the Posca one, but next man, it, it is gonna be tough. This is when the video gets hard, man, cause I never, I like never use these. These are watercolor pencils. I have no idea how to use these, I'm gonna be honest. I, I got no idea what I'm doing, no experience, but this is different mediums and I had to. I had to for this video, so I gotta figure something out. Listen, I, I did watch a tutorial. I did watch a tutorial. What I'm going to do, my game plan is I'm going to lay down the colored pencil and then I'm going to pray and then I'm going to add the water in. So let's see how it goes. So you can see here, I started adding into the water on top of the colored pencil. Like they, they are the watercolor pencils. So I wasn't using enough water at first too. I, I was just, I was just experimenting, you know, I dipped the colored pencil in like an actual water, the pencil tip in the water, tried to color with that. But listen, let me, let me add some water to this hair and see how it comes looking like. Anyway, man, watercolor clay is done. Wh which medium looks the best so far? Y'all gotta let me know. Let me know, but we gotta move on to what I think is probably gonna be the hardest one. So I think this is gonna be my hardest challenge. This is the Karen Dodge. I hope I pronounced that right, but the Karen Dodge crayons. Now these are water soluble. So 
I am gonna add some water to it. Same thing I did with the watercolor crayons. I'm gonna be adding water to this one too. So I mean, I, I got no idea how this is gonna come. Now I have seen a lot of um, other YouTubers use these pencils and they look really cool. So I, I wanted to try them, but I didn't really watch a tutorial for this. I kind of just hopped right into it. You know, sometimes, you know, sometimes you just gotta hop right into it. Hop right into things, but I don't know, man. Maybe I should have watched something. I was super stressed around this point. At this point here, I had no idea how this was gonna turn out. Anyway, you can see how this clay came out looking like. I hated it at first, but it's kind of, it kind of grew on me. I'm not gonna lie. But anyway, moving on, we got the last medium here which is gonna be colored pencils. So I haven't, I haven't really used colored pencils to color in a face, like, or try to make it attempt to look like semi-realistically in a long time. So I'm a little bit rusty with this, but we gotta see how this comes out. But listen, man, this is this is the last clay. This is, you know, the fourth quarter. I gotta end strong. We, we gotta go crazy with this one. I gotta make sure it comes out right. So let me add in these details and then I'm gonna show you what all the clays look like. I gotta see which medium looks the best. Hey man, you can see all the clay, different mediums of clay are laid out. Listen, like I said, y'all let me know which medium you like the best. Me personally, I think I might go with the crayons. I might, I might have to go into crayons. I'm not gonna. I kind of like how that looks. I'm gonna be using those more in the future. But anyway, thanks for watching this video. More videos coming soon. Please subscribe if you haven't already. And man, I'm out.